Ode to a Favourite Cat, Drowned in a Tub of Goldfishes by Thomas Gray. Twas on a lofty vase's side, where China's gayest art had died, the azure flowers that blow, demurest of the tabby kind, the pensive Selima reclined, gazed on the lake. Her conscious tale her joy declared, the fair round face, the snowy beard, the velvet of her paws, her coat that with the tortoise vies, her ears of jet and emerald eyes, she saw and purred applause. Still had she gazed, but midst the tide two angel forms were seen to glide the genie of the stream. Their scaly armour's Tyrian hue through richest purple to the view betrayed a golden gleam. The hapless nymph with wonder saw a whisker first and then a claw. With many an ardent wish she stretched in vain to reach the prize. What female heart can gold despise? What cats averse to fish? Presumptuous maid! With looks intent, still she stretched, still she bent, nor knew the gulf between. Malignant fate sat by and smiled. The slippery verge her feet beguiled, she tumbled headlong in. Eight times! Emerging from the flood, she mewed to every watery god some speedy aid to send. No dolphin came, no nereid stirred, nor cruel Tom nor Susan heard. A favourite has no friend. From hence ye beauties undeceived know. One false step is ne'er retrieved. And be with caution bold. Not all that tempts your wandering eyes and heedless hearts is lawful prize. Nor all that glisters gold.